Hi everyone, this is Michelle, Learning to Be Thin. Um, happy day after Easter. I'm sharing with you a video today to kind of give you ideas of what to do besides eating the Easter candy that's in your house and the leftover ham and all the salty, fatty crap that we have around today. Um, I came across this PDF called uh, Am I Hungry? Eat Mindfully, Live Vibrantly. It's 101 things to do besides eating. And I'm going to read this to you because it really made me feel good reading it because I do some of them already and it gave me some great ideas. So enjoy this. Print out the list yourself. Use it. When you realize that the desire to eat is due to head hunger rather than true hunger, you can choose to do another activity to redirect your attention away from food until the urge passes uh, or until you really feel hungry. Highlight the ideas that appeal to you. Add some of your own. Remember to try to choose activities that are enjoyable, available, and preferably eating inco incompatible. You can, uh, you'll can, you need both quick and involved activities. Create a distraction kit with everything you need and establish a pleasant food-free zone in your home or office that is perfect to retreat in these moments. Here's the list. Imagine a healthier, energetic you. Walk around the block, call a friend, make a list of your top 10 reasons to get active, read a child a book. Love that. Do a to-do list, dance a little, plan a vacation, get a massage, jot a thank you note to someone, go to bed early, read a great book, write in your awareness journal, give yourself a manicure or pedicure. I did that today. Plan a healthy meal for your family, surf the internet, finish an unfinished project, walk your dog, feel your feelings. Volunteer in your community, start a hobby, brush your teeth, tape your favorite show, watch it while exercising. Take five slow, deep cleansing breaths. Practice an instrument, balance your checkbook. Plan a party, say a prayer. Buy yourself some flowers, do a few setups, make a phone call to someone you like. Chop vegetables to keep on hand. Set your priorities. Try a new hairstyle. Give a massage, write, write about something that you're proud of this week. Clean out your junk drawer. Play a game with your kids. Try a new route on your walk. Scream! I like that too. Plant uh, fresh herbs to use in your cooking. I'm going to do that today, actually. Drink a glass of water. Kiss someone. Try on some clothes. Catch up on your reading for work. Uh, look at old pictures. Rent a video. Smell the roses. Wash your car. Chew some gum. Plan a date for someone special. Swim a few laps. Read what you love. Read, eat what you love. Must be a book out there. Take a hot, soothing bath. Update your calendar. Get it off your chest. Build something. Check in on an elderly person. Work on your yard. Start your holiday shopping list. Count your blessings. Write a letter. Fold some laundry. Listen to your inner conversations. Take a nap. Run an errand. Work on your budget. Take a bike ride. Check your email. Make a positive statement about yourself and repeat it often. Give your dog a bath. Start a project that you've been wanting to get around to. Send a birthday card. Meditate. Try a delicious new recipe. Play cards. Set your goals. Freshen your makeup. Hug someone. Rearrange your furniture. Go take a hike. Help someone with homework. Light a fire or some candles. Say stop out loud. Put your pictures in an album. Walk around your workplace. Try a new rel relaxation technique. Talk it over with someone. Get a head start on your taxes. Okay. Stretch. Do a honey-do list. Say what's on your mind. Go pick up your mail. Straighten the closet. Think. Do something nice for someone anonymously. Check the stock market. Plan a romantic encounter. Clean up the files. Tell someone how you really feel. And when you become truly physically hungry, eat what you love and love what you eat. That is from the website amihungry.com. And I also want to add on there, pick any one of these things and make a video about it. That's 101 ideas for, for a YouTube video too. Have a great day, guys. I hope that you can do something today good for yourself and something that you love. Choose to be good to the person that's always going to be with you, yourself. And um, have a great day. Bye.